Here's a lesson on how your Magnavox Calero record changer works. First of all, you set your speed right there. You can change the speed all day long with the power off. Can't do it while the power's on, so set it to 45. Your overarm comes over here. This is your 45 adapter. You'll see right on here it says that face is front. It's not always perfectly front, but mostly front. You'll, you'll find where it needs to go. Put your 45s on there. Your overarm does not have to be there. Sometimes this won't allow it anyway, so that can be over there. Make sure your tone arm's not locked down. Turn it to auto, which is just beyond on. Taps the record for size goes down and plays. At the end of each record, it'll go to the next record automatically. Taps the record to determine it's a seven inch record. Sets down in the appropriate spot. Always make sure your record is clean and your needle is clean. Before you play each record, blow the needle off. If you have dirty records, want to go to the next record, do this. If you have dirty records, the needle will get dirty on the back side of the needle, so you can blow forward this direction. There's a mute switch in there that mutes the circuit so it doesn't make noise when it's tapping the record. This will automatically turn off at the end of a record because it'll sense that there isn't another record. Goes over, went beyond seven inches, so it turns off. 